title of this video Disgusting Money Spirits. What do I mean when I talk about Disgusting Money Spirits? All of us have something raging inside of us, as in spiritual warfare, something going on. This, these disgusting money spirits could come in the form of generational curses or through soul ties or anything basically. It's just like you're at the point, a person's soul is at the point now it's let up with it's just filled with basically nothing and would basically be at the point where you'll do anything to get your next dollar. Basically. And you don't care who you gotta hurt or you gotta kill. Whatever you gotta do by means necessary to get your next dollar, you'll do it. And you don't care what it is. You don't care who you hurt, you don't care what what happens or anything else. And even the people that have to sacrifice family members or babies or anything else to get it, they don't care, they'll do it anyway. These are the types of, these aren't people, I'm looking at the spiritual aspects of the spirits. And these are the disgusting money spirits. I'll go even deeper than that saying selfish spirits because the root cause of it is being selfish. It's thinking about this hard tonight. And it all comes down to the root issue. What is the root issue at all of these disgusting money spirits? It's selfishness. That is the root cause of it. And honestly, it could come in the form of you building up yourself and being a true born narcissist. All in it for you. Which I think we all can be like that sometimes, but there's a difference than just being like a small one versus, because I think in a firm way we're all kind of, we are a little bit on the edge of being narcissists, but there's a difference between just being like that and you can actually get yourself out. You have the capability of putting yourself in someone's shoes, but a true born high, I'm talking about a high function narcissist, is basically like a radical. I'll, come, I'll even go ahead and say that radicals. Radicals as what? As in me, full blown out selfish. They will put up masks, do whatever they gotta do. It's all in it for them, whatever they gotta do to get to that money. They don't care if they have to get you killed to get their, their next fix, to get high off your essence, or do whatever they gotta do to get uh, feel whatever they want, whatever they want, and it's like, well, maybe I'm not talking about fully in to maybe a sociopath in a way too, so a little bit of both, but you kind of get what I'm saying, people now, and, it, and it's just so many people now, and it's just like, this is not what we're supposed to be doing as believers, but we come into this world, born in this world to show our light of Christ, we just world and I'll tell you from experience that I am horrible at sometimes like letting my temper go, like my mouth. Um, but these disgusting money spirits, like man, going back to what I'm saying, I want to get on topic that. At the end of the day, this stuff burns. The root cause of that is selfishness. And the time that people start realizing that as just a human. The faster we are at learning things, the more quickly in the spirit. I just said that. So, but God said during the end times it would be like this: people would be lovers of themselves. Uh, they would have hardened hearts. Uh, they'd be boasters, very proud, high mighty. There'd be mockers, there'd be scoffers of the gospel. You name it. So, God bless. God bless. God bless. Amen. 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 God speed us in my message. Fire and ice. Here we come. Power and anointing. Fire and ice.